<laughs> All right, so, well, unfortunately, this past weekend, man, we lost the great John Lewis, and many government officials Ooh. jumped on social media to honor the late civil rights leader and politician, including Senator Marco Rubio. Now, although Marco most likely had the best of intentions, he made a major hiccup by posting a photo of the late civil rights activist and U.S. Representative Elijah Cummings uh. instead of John Lewis in his initial tweet. Now, Jeez. and you know black Twitter, yo, we on it like a hawk, man. Yeah. So they was on his neck immediately, and uh, listen, so he quickly changed the photo to a nice picture of him and Mr. Lewis and admitted his mistake. And a right. lot of people were saying they did look yeah. similar on that picture. Yeah, yeah but, I mean, you're still strong and wrong, you know, they just sort of jumped wrong. at him, but... <laughs> But it happens to the best of us. Even the newest member of the Dish Nation family, Sherry Shepard, didn't want Marco Rubio to feel bad about his Twitter gaffe, so <laughs> she posted her Google search screenshot and posted it to social media with this caption. And you're not alone, Senator Marco Rubio. <laughs> Corporations confuse me for Octavia Spencer all the time. <laughs> oh what do you God. think it is? The round face? Is it the boobs? And you know oh, what? Just wow. to verify this, we went to Google ourselves this morning, and it was still like this. So we this gotta make that change. This is disrespectful. They need to change this right now. Both women are super famous in their own right. Like hell no, you yeah. will not be mixing them up like this. Right. <laughs> right. Oh, but nobody gets up in arms when they think I'm Amy Poehler or Terry Polo. Oh, no one has a problem. Or with Hulk that. Hogan. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Hulk Hogan. Hulk Hogan. Yeah, what's his name? Uh, he is really? very famous. <laughs> <laughs> you are not allowed to wear bandanas, Heidi. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>